a chief executive officer under siege. This is the situation the Kenyatta National Hospital boss Lily Koros finds herself in following sexual harassment claims by nursing mothers at the facility. I was going to the nursery and there were two guys coming from 1D. They were pushing this big trolley. They were wearing white overcoats and white gum boots and they had greenish uniforms. When we were almost close to each other, I moved. Then the guy pushed the trolley towards me. There's a wall. There's a place that has some sort of barrier. Mm -hmm. He pushed the um, trolley towards me and he opened. One of them opened the thing. That's when I saw the bodies. I ran and one of them actually ran after me. Majority apparently not convinced by her recent bid to absolve the facility from blame. Even before investigations into the claims are concluded, Kenya National Union of Nurses Secretary General Seth Panyako wants Koros to take ultimate responsibility. <laughs> Panyako wondering how a health facility of Kenyatta National Hospital's caliber could fail to have CCTV cameras. We cannot allow wakonja wetu wende kunyanyasha na watu kwa hospitali ku kama ya Kenyatta. In Nairobi's Kibra constituency, a women's group also broke its silence over the sensitive matter that has loudly been condemned by calling on KNH management to prioritize the safety of expectant and nursing mothers. Led by Hamilda Tohir, who is the chairperson of Kibera Local Forum, the women at the same time call for speedy investigations into their allegations. We are disappointed, to say the least. Mothers admitted in the hospital, a majority are low-income earners and grappling with medical bills, of which majority of the women, expectant mothers, come from the same same constituency, Kibra constituency, whereby the hospital is next to them. Safe delivery is every woman's dream. But once she's forced to remain in hospital with a baby in the incubator, means there's a problem. Therefore, allegations of rape should be condemned in strongest words possible. Sentiments echoed by Nyandaro women representative Faith Gitao, who called for enhanced security within the hospital premises amid ongoing probe. Whatever is happening in Kenyatta National Hospital is really disheartening. And we are saying that we are demanding and we are even talking to the, the CS uh, Health that we want one word for both the, 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 the newborn babies and the mothers. The security in Kenyatta National Hospital is pathetic and we are saying that the security in Kenyatta Hospital must be beefed uh, completely because of the, the cases that we are having right now. The health ministry has since ordered a probe into the allegations. Caroline Kamar reporting for Channel 1 Weekend.